Hey there, Dave Carvassier in the Channel 8 Newsroom this Thursday. Thanks for stopping by 8newsnow.com. You know, we're starting to wonder here in the newsroom if this is getting to be a trend or copycat crimes because today there was another robbery of casino chips from a major resort. Uh, this happened at the Rio this morning. Guy got away with, they think, about $35,000 worth of casino chips. He even had his hand slapped by the dealer, but we'll tell you how he got away with it. A man apparently trying to break into an apartment today, a shot by a police officer. We'll explain uh, how that all went down. We'll take a look at HOAs, homeowner associations. Associations uh, They're really hurting these days because they get their dues from homeowners, and homeowners are suffering because of the foreclosure crisis. So state legislators are really considering some big changes uh, to the way that uh, HOAs operate. Uh, Jonathan Humbert has a pretty good I-Team report about double-dipping. Government workers who are, are on the clock for their first government job but are doing stuff on the side for a second government uh, job. Uh, it's a pretty interesting expose. We'll take you there for that. Toyota has another recall of some cars of theirs, uh, this time again for accelerator problems. Uh, George Knapp has another look at the BLM considering uh, revamping its entire Wild Horse uh, uh, Roundup program. They say they're going to uh, take a look at it from top to bottom. We'll tell you what he says about that. A shuttle launch today, uh, the last shuttle launch for Discovery, but not the last shuttle launch of the program. We'll explain that and have a lot more for you coming up on our news between 4 and 6.30. We'll see you then.